There is no greater agony than bearing an untold story inside of you. Maya Angelou. This is my story. Growing up in Malakoff, this is where it all started for me. This is where it all began. Growing up in a single parent home with my two brothers and my mom, I'm trying to find a way to make it out the struggle, not necessarily knowing where the next meal would come from. To keep going from day to day, my mom worked two jobs to keep us out of the streets. Uh, she fed us and made sure we ate each and every day, and there were times where she went to bed and she didn't eat. She taught us how to be men because, well, our fathers weren't around, and to try and teach us how to be men and how to become what they were, I guess. Uh, she taught us how to grind for what we wanted. She told us that there are going to be dark times, uh, times where it seems like there's no light in the darkness. She said you can grieve through those moments and be sad for a little while, but life keeps going and you can either pick yourself back up and keep moving forward or you can stay there. But whatever you do, life doesn't stop for anyone. But if you know how great you are and you know your words, nothing will keep you from success or keeping you from picking yourself off the ground. The key to success is to focus our conscious mind on things we desire, not things we fear. This is why I'm here and this is why I have to make it. I'm not doing this for me anymore. I'm not doing this for selfish reasons. It's to continue her legacy. This is why I have to make it. This is why I'm gonna make it. Putting everything I had to go through to, to get to where I am now, and I'm carrying it on my back. Through her death, through the depression it caused me, through the thoughts of suicide, through each and every person telling me that I'm not made for the moment or I can't do it. I have to keep going because my story isn't done. My story is just now beginning. It's not about how you start, it's about how you finish. I will always remember where I came from, what I've gone through and what I had to go through to get here. Uh, there will always be dark times, but there will always be light in those dark times. Remain focused, remain humble keep that light and let it shine and continue to let God lead the way with him all things are possible My name is Jared Givens, and this is my story. <laughs>